George Petrich. George Washington Petrich, 22 February 1817, March 1934, was a German composer and capelmaster. Life. Born in Dresden, Petrich attended the Hochschule for Music Karl Maria von Weber from 1884 to 1890, whose curriculum included theoretical subjects and keyboard, string and wind instruments. In addition, the students were taught oratory and singing. The curriculum also included stage training. The conservatory was founded in 1856 as a private teaching institution and, on its 25th anniversary in 1880, won the King of Saxony awarded it the title of Royal Conservatory. His teachers at the conservatory were Ferdinand Braun wrote 1856-1913 for harmony, counterpoint, and piano, Felix Driesek, 1835-1913, for theory of form and higher composition, Adolf Hagen, 1851-1926, for orchestral, compositional, and directorial theory and practice in direction. Petrich received an organ prize donated by the Dresden City Council in 1888 after six months of organ lessons with Emil Hoppner. On the occasion of the 40th anniversary of the Assumption of Patronage of the Dresden Conservatory by the Crown Prince of Saxony in 1898, in the presence of the now King Albert of Saxony, two songs composed by Pittrich were performed at the festive event, among others, Hofnung and Dueline. At a concert given by the Conservatoire in the autumn of 1888, Pittrich played the prelude and fugue for organ in B minor, by Johann Sebastian Bach and the Sonata for Organ, for Four Hands, in D minor, by Gustav Merkel together with his fellow pupil Paul Klausnitzer from Niederskona, who had also attended Hopner's organ lessons and also received the school. In July 1890, Petrich took part in a song recital in Shandau. He played at the grand concert, the Sonata in a flat major, Op. 110, first movement by Beethoven and an etude, in C minor by Chopin, as well as a work composed by himself, a nocturne in F sharp major. After his musical training, which he completed with distinction, Petrich obtained a position as repetitor at the Semper Opera in Dresden in 1890. At theater rehearsals, he had to accompany the actors by playing the piano instead of the orchestra. Outside of his full-time occupation, the young pianist was temporarily active in 1892 as director or conductor of the Dresden Male Choral Society Liedergruss in Main Holds, sale with practice hours once a week. He also filled the position of music teacher at the Saxon Court from 1895 to 1898. In this capacity, George Washington Pittrich was temporarily the teacher of the then Crown Princess at the Saxon Royal Court, Archduchess Louise of Austria. Collaboration in the Tonkunstler Verein Petrich joined the Tonkunstler Verein zu Dresden, founded in 1854 as a pianist and composer after completing his studies at the Hochschule für Musik Karl Maria von Weber in 1890, which also had members from outside. He became acquainted with musical works there that had not been rehearsed before, educated himself by making music together, and presented his own compositions. The Fantasy for Pianoforte and String Orchestra, composed by him, and at that time only available as a manuscript, was performed by Petrich for the first time in 1893 at a practice session of the association. Songs composed by him were performed in 1898 with his participation at the piano. As a singer, Ernst Wachter, 1872-1931, from the Semper Oper in Dresden made himself available to the Tonkunstler Verein as a singer. As Kapelmeister in Hamburg and Frankfurt, Petrich is named in the reports on the Tonkunstler Verein as a foreign member, after he was still listed as repetitor and composer in the membership directory among the Dresden artists in the reporting year 1897-98. Awards Petrich was awarded the Certificate of Maturity as a pianist, composer, and conductor by decision of the teaching staff of the Conservatory on 16 March 1890, having already received the certificate as organist the year before. 
as a composition student from the class of the conservator's teacher Felix Driesek. He received an award from the Frederick Pudor Foundation in the 1989-90 school year for the sheets music of the Mass in B minor by Johann Sebastian Bach. He received a prize certificate for excellent performance as a piano player from the piano class of Bertrand Roth. In 1894, the composer and repetitor at the Court Theatre was awarded the Royal Saxon Order of Merit, the Albert Order. It was the year in which the opera Marga, composed by Pittrich, was performed in Dresden at the beginning of February and achieved a complete success. Accident Pittrich was bitten by a poisonous snake on the Baltic Sea near Lomen on Rugen in August 1894. This caused his hand and arm to swell dangerously up to the armpit. He had to travel to Greifswald, where a university professor was able to counteract the blood poisoning with effective remedies, the German-language American newspaper the Indiana Tribune reported promptly from Saxony on 23 August about the carpeteter der Conigal, Hofoper Jor Pittrich in Dresden. It would not have taken much for the young artist to meet an untimely end, wrote the Dresden writer and editor Roder on the accident of Pittrich, then a member of the Koniglisch Musicalist Kapel, and a young composer. Philip Ernst Roder, 1862-1897, also mentioned in the biographical sketch that it was the bite of a viper on the island of Rugen, which the Greifswald University Hospital successfully treated. A year earlier, Pittrich was introduced to the newspaper readers of the Indiana Tribune, as a young composer in connection with the announcement of his one-act opera Mara presented as the first new production at the Dresden Court Opera. In doing so, the news from Dresden highlighted the first-class cast, e.g. with the Kammersanger and Therese Muller, 1850-1930, called Malton. At the piano, Pittrich accompanied Dresden singers at out-of-town performances, such as the Royal Saxon Court opera singer Maria Bossenberger, 1872-1919, on 29 March 1898, when she performed Lieder in Leipzig as part of the Liszt Verein's concert. Kapelmeister at several German theaters. Following his musical activity as a repetitor at the Dresden Court Theater, Pittrich became a conductor at various German theaters, including Hamburg from 1898, Frankfurt from 1901 in Dresden, at the Central Theater from 1904. Pittrich first stood at the conductor's podium in Berlin in 1911, when the operetta Der Verboten Kuss was performed in the ancient Altkommist Opera Berlin, reported the Berlin journalist Leo Heller, 1876-1941. In the spring of 1912, the Central Theater in Dresden hosted the farewell benefit in favor of the longtime popular Kapelmeister, who went as conductor to Berlin's Wintergarten. During his time as first Kapelmeister at the Berlin Wintergarten Theater and composer, Pittrich lived in the then rural community of Zeilendorf, just outside the capital. From 1914, Pittrich worked in Nuremberg. There, he was Kapelmeister at the Stad Theater from 1922. He also worked as a teacher of role studies at the Nuremberg Conservatory. In Nuremberg, Pittrich called himself by his first names George Washington, as the official address book in Dresden already recorded him by name. With his Christian name George Washington, Pittrich became known as a composer in the U.S. as well as in England. The I'm Warner Butch Nuremberg 1928 identifies J. Pittrich as a Kapelmeister as well as a conductor. In particular, he was active at that time as a choral director at the local Altenstadt Theater. Pittrich's birthday coincided with that of the first American President George Washington on 22 February, and so it happened that his father Carl Gottlob, later Gottlob, Pittrich 1831-1908, who at that time was employed by the American Club, gave him the president's name as his first name. Creations Creations The composer earned his first fee with the commission to create music for Schiller's The Maid of Orleans. The 21-year-old rehearsed his composition with the court orchestra and conducted the orchestra himself when the drama was first performed in Dresden in 1891. The composer dedicated two of his songs, the Weijendlied 
and the song Magdalene, Nim Ditch, and Itched to the Royal Saxon Chamber singer Clementine von Schuchproska, 1850-1932, which appeared in autumn 1891 and became immediately popular. Pittrich wrote music for operas and plays. For example, under the name George Pittrich, he composed the music belonging to the plot for the play Das Marchen von Gluck, whereby the right to perform and the sheet music could be obtained from the author, Adele Osterloh, through the mediation of E. Pearson's Verlags Butchen Lung in Dresden and Leipzig. The music critic and writer Friedrich Adolf Jaisler, 1868-1931, judged Pittrich to be a highly gifted and energetic capel maester, and referred to his musically excellent preparation of the performance. Previously, the music critic Jaisler attested to capel maester Pittrich that he had proved himself as a finely sensitive, secure and spirited conductor in the best possible way, referring to the first performances of Die Dollar Prinzessin by Leo Foll and Heinrich Burt's operetta Der Klein Chevalier in Dresden in 1907 by the Central Theatre. Among the successful compositions of Pittrich's Dresden period was the music for the Christmas fairy tale Die Mosikonigin or Wider Walden die Stadtkam, for which F. A. Jaisler wrote the text. The play saw its 25th performance at the Dresden Central Theater on 4 January 1906. The music critic Ludwig Hartmann, 1836-1910, praised Pittrich as a talented conductor who worked discipline and delicacy out of the original vaudeville orchestra of the Dresden Central Theater. And he referred to the quality of the conducting of Leo Foll's 1873-1925 operette at the Merry Farmer. Portrait a portrait of the composer George Pittrich was published in the official journal of the Deutscher, Boon und Verein Boon und Welten 1899-1900. He is characterized there by Gobi Eberhardt as a talented young musician, whose opera Marga met with great acclaim in Dresden. As a young musician, Pittrich dressed in tailcoat and white dress shirt with black bow tie, resting his left hand on a dresser and touching his waistcoat, with his right hand on the pocket watch chain was portrayed by the Royal Saxon and Royal Prussian court photographer Wilhelm Hoffert. A bust portrait of this motif was published in 1896 in the biographical critical sketches of the Dresden Court Theatre. Court supplier Hoffert advertised with the coats of arms of the Saxon and Prussian ruling houses as well as that of the Prince of Wales in the cabinet photo. A hip picture of Pittrich, photographed in 1902, by the court photographer Arthur Marx in Frankfurt, has been in the collection of the Stadt und Universitätsbibliothek there since 2003. At that time, Pittrich worked as second Kapelmeister of the United Municipal Theatres in Frankfurt, especially from 1901 at the Opera House. The Contemporary Theatre Memorial printed a portrait photo of him, and it called the Kapelmeister by his first and family name George Pittrich while in the address book, for 1902, he was entered with the name Pittrich George Doe. Then, Doe. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. The portrait in the theater memorial shows Pittrich with a mustache in a dark suit, standing in front of a round table while leaning with his right hand on a book lying there. In May 1901, when Pittrich was still working in Hamburg as Kapelmeister, he had a print of the original of the soprano Bianca Bianchi, actually widowed Polini plus 1897, Schwarz, 1855-1947, on the occasion of her farewell from the stage with a Handerton dedication on the back. Legacy Pittrich died in Nuremberg at the age of 64. As early as 1931, he was listed in his last function as head of the drama music and no longer as choral director as still in 1930 at the Vereinigte Statistische Theater Nuremberg Firth. His flat was at Campus Trasse 4 in the Nuremberg district of St. Johannes. The Nuremberg musicologist Wilhelm Dupont 1905-1992 compiled an index of the composer Pittrich's works between 1890 and 1908. In an obituary of the Jenison-Staff Deutscher, Boonen and Jaharijer for the Dead from the month of March 1934, the editor emphasized with Pittrich that he had made many friends. The eldest son of George Washington Pittrich and his wife Else, 
concert timpani with hand-hammered copper kettles in kettle sizes according to the Petrich Dresner tradition go back to an invention of his father Karl, also Karl Petrich, when he was orchestra servant of the court orchestra in Dresden in 1881. Since 1872, Petrich developed a construction with which the skin tension of the timpani is regulated by pedal steps and not by a crank. The association Straster Music, founded in 2009 in Haussall, included Georg Petrich in the list of Central German composers' jubilees for the year 2020 on the occasion of his 150th birthday. The surname Petrich is the Upper German form of the name Petrich, Middle High German, Buterichen means something like a bulbous drinking vessel, but was also used as a derisive name for the well-off. Work was Eicherwald. Three songs for voice and piano, Opus 4. Music for the plot of Die Blonde Catherine. Ein Marchenspiel Natch and Dersen von Richard Voss. Song Hoffnung for one singing voice with pianoforte, Opus 18, Coronation March from the Maid of Orleans, Schlaf, Main Sonchen, Schlaf Bald, Lullaby for Voice and Piano, Kegel Bruder Marsh, 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 Uder 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 Marsh, Marsh. Serenade for Small Orchestra, Opus 21, date of composition around 1899. Music for Das March in Von Gluck, play in four acts. Poetry, Adele Osterloh. Music for Marga, opera in one act, performed in Dresden in 1894 under Ernst von Schutz. Three songs for male choir, Opus 35, Always Stirring, Always Moving, Mur ist als ob der Frühling, Du lieber Goldner Sonnenschein, Trumpeter Stanchion for B-flat Trumpet Cornet with Piano, Opus 37, Ich hab auf meiner Wanderung, Wanderlied for male voice and piano, Opus 38, Barcarolle, Opus 41, Work for violin with piano accompaniment, first published 1901. A Bendlied, Opus 42, Deutsch Local Nachricht Publication C. 1902. Petschvogel und Latchdog. Tans Nach Texten von Karl Schademantel. A Bendlied for String Orchestra. Opus 42. Alexander March for Piano. Opus 60. Central Theater March for Piano, date of composition 1905. Music for the Christmas Fairy Tale, The Mouse Queen C. 1905-6. Music for The Star of Bethlehem. Ein Deutsches Weitnacht on Krippenspiel in Wir Bildern by F. A. Jaisler C. 1908. Hasserenfiber, March for Orchestra or Piano. Date of Composition, 1908. Beethoven, I invite you to a serious celebration. Music for Princess Tyrandot. Subtitled Charit Natch Carlo Gazi by Walfried Burgraff, who composed it in 1923 under the pseudonym Friedrich Forster. Music for the ballet Petschvogel on Latch Taub, Pantomimistisch Tanzmarchen by Karl Schademantel, 1859 minus 1923.